Hello everyone. Welcome to Ruth Straight Talk, the channel designed to help teachers, parents and students live fuller lives, become lifelong learners and grow into the awesome human beings you were designed to be. I'm Cynthia Ruth. In this video, I will show you several things that you can do to maximize your child's success. So let's just get right to it. Since online schooling is difficult for most students, you can help your child by doing certain things before he begins. Take a closer look at your child's skills. Is your child on grade level in reading and math? Is he self-motivated, disciplined, organized? Is he or she an independent learner? Are they good with time management? Are they technology savvy? All of these skills will help your child to do better in online schooling. However, they're not that difficult and you can, with your assistance, can help your child to learn these skills. Every one of these skills will help your child succeed in online schooling. The second thing you can do to maximize your child's online learning experience is to make sure that she has the adequate equipment needed for her classes. For example, she will need a proper and reliable internet connection, a computer that is designated for her class time that she can spend as much time as needed to complete her assignments. She will need a printer with a scanner capability and headphones, microphones and webcams so that she can participate in class time and online discussions. Of course, she will need the regular papers and pencils, highlighters and school supplies that every student needs. This will definitely help her to do better in her classes. Please check to make sure that your computer is adequate for her specific online class. The third thing you can do to maximize online learning is to designate a certain area of the child's room that can be set aside for school only. When your child enters into that area, the first thing they think about is, I've got to go to school. I'm set, I have the mindset of schoolwork. This area should have a desk, ample lighting, and several types of seating, perhaps a, a computer chair for when working on the computer, and a different area like a small sofa where the child can do independent reading, or take a test or any other type of work that needs to be done for the class. This area should include a section where your child's computer and printer and printed work can be stored. Keep in mind that the computer should be eye level for the child and the chair should have a supportive back that allows them to sit comfortably for several hours if necessary. The fourth thing you can do to help your child is to set a daily schedule. That schedule should coincide with the online classes, but must also include time for children who are having difficulty with a specific subject would have extra time to work on their assignments. The fifth thing you can do is set a weekly placing guide. This will help your child to stay on top of every assignment and you will not miss a deadline. Deadlines are very, very important in online schooling. So keeping your child on task, on schedule with her assignments will make a world of difference to her success. Keep in mind that whether your child is in online school or not, every parent should stay on top of your child's educational development. Thank you so much for visiting with us at RuthStraightTalk.com. If this video has helped you, please like us and leave us a comment at the bottom of the screen. And please subscribe to my channel for more great videos like this one. Until next time, happy learning and goodbye.